Well, well with the, like all the Foresight guys, uh, I've been working with them all of the last few years, and uh, it was really interesting to sort of like uh, take uh, in immediate sort of direction and try and you know click into what what was being brought uh, to me as, as the uh, as a writer. And <laughs> John brought this crazy world, which I balked at for a long time. It was like the whole planet is a is a cemetery, and there's these story these stories that are going to come in at like about <clears throat> 45 degree angles and stop in the stream of the story. Like there's these really strange ideas that were uh, beautiful, and he was very committed to them. I don't. I, there's some writers that um, their dialogue just fits in your mouth, perfect. You know. And, uh, yeah, I, I love his, uh, his writing. The femme fatale, but then she realizes that Charlie's different than the other one. So. Also, Charlie serves a greater purpose in setting her free. So, you know, she has an agenda. She's not totally, you know, altruistic. Yeah. Well, SimCity has like a has a, uh, a retro type vibe yeah. to it, and so does ours. So I guess that's. Yeah, but like, what's cool with those type of cars? So <laughs> it's like I can't think of wanting to model any other type of cars than, than those. <laughs> Too much work. Yeah. <laughs> even this, I'm like, if, if you value your social life, I wouldn't even attempt to do it.